New Jersey provides $100 million in repair or rebuilding funds to strengthen its famous Jersey Shore boardwalks. $100 million in funds to rebuild or repair boardwalks will go toward the walkway in the Jersey Shore town where Bruce Springsteen got his start in music and the connection between the casinos in Atlantic City and the beach, some Jersey Shore boardwalks that will share $100 million in repair and reconstruction funds are a wooden walkway next to Atlantic City casinos that is said to be the nation's first boardwalk and a similar coastal thoroughfare in Bruce Springsteen's home. On Friday, 18 Jersey Shore towns were selected by New Jersey to receive a share of $100 million from a new program designed to finance boardwalk expansions, reconstructions, and repairs. The recognizable wooden boardwalks that crisscross the beach and serve as the hub of many well-known coastal resort communities. The funding, which is intended to assist nearby shore towns in covering the costs of what has been an expensive undertaking for many, comes from federal COVID-19 recovery funds under the American Rescue Act. Democratic Governor Phil Murphy said, So many of us have made memories at the Jersey Shore boardwalks with family and friends. We want to keep our boardwalks a sought-after destination by assisting shore communities in maintaining and repairing these wooden main streets. The state's acting commissioner of community affairs, Jacqueline Suarez, stated that although boardwalks are a significant source of revenue for coastal communities and the areas surrounding them, local governments must spend a great deal of money maintaining, repairing, and strengthening them. Asbury Park and Atlantic City, two of the most well-known boardwalks in the state, will each receive $20 million for their walkways, constructed in 1870 to prevent guests of seaside hotels from bringing sand into their structures. Atlantic City's boardwalk is considered the nation's first, according to both the state and the city. Rock star Bruce Springsteen was born and raised in Freehold, New Jersey, but he is forever linked to Asbury Park, where he developed his sound in small-town performances before becoming well-known. North Wildwood, Wildwood, are the other recipients of funding. Ventnor, Cape May, Bradley Beach, Long Branch, Carteret, Sea Isle City, Belmer, Brigantine, Wildwood Crest, Toms River, Keyport, and Berkeley Township. A portion of the funds might be granted as grants to companies that must make changes to fit in with the new boardwalks.